Okay. I'm alive, but my hair is messed up. <laughs> All right, guys. I was a little late today because I was having so much fun. That's why. But now I plan on having more with you guys. So how's that sound? All righty. Here we go. You know I have my special guest today, right? Ricky, come over here. I want to introduce my special guest. She just got comfortable. Now I get to get her up. If you guys notice in the top chat, I put uh, Foxy Roxy Ventures, and without an S, Venture, or, we, or you won't be able to find her, and mine up there. So for the first half of the auction, we're going to do Foxy Roxy. So when you go to pay for something, if you win a lot and you want it, you just go to Foxy Roxy Ventures, Venture without an S, <laughs> until I say don't. <laughs> say hi, Ricky. Hello. Hi, Ricky. <laughs> <laughs> hi, everybody. Ricky knows more about me than my entire family does. She <laughs> knows all the secrets and she's not allowed to tell. So don't bother. She won't tell on me. <laughs> anyway. Um, today we're going to do, uh, let me look at the, let me look at the phone cause you know, it's much better. Um, so I can say hi to everybody, but if you look at where I clicked, you know, where we normally go to go on my Poshmark, um, mine is on the top one. Then it says, or, and right now we're going to use the bottom link that says Foxy Roxy. Foxy Roxy is her cute little dog that's a miniature and he look and she is a foxy little Roxy. <laughs> she looks just like a fox. So Shiba we're going to huh? Shiba Inu. Is what her What name. is she? She's a Shiba Inu. Oh, I never see I, Japanese, I would never remember Japanese, that. Japanese hunting dog. Japanese hunting dog. And I'll show you a picture when we're all done today cuz I do have some on my phone. So right now we're going to do like five units of Foxy Roxy Venture and then we'll switch over to Grandma Ventures and do five more and then we'll just do that for a while. Ah, oh, you guys showed up on a surprise. This was a surprise one today and there's also a surprise one in the morning at 10. We're going to do two more hours. Ricky's trying to figure out how to do this and I, she's going to be a natural. Yeah. All righty. Okay, Ricky, thank you. Okay. I'm giving her permission to go sit down. <laughs> uh, she doesn't take offense no matter what I do. Yeah, no. Oh well, I there might be there might be something she would, but I won't I won't go there. All right. Um hello Joyce. Hello, Catherine. Callie's here. Joanne. Alexis. Edie. It's been a while. Jody. Denise. That's a good name. <laughs> Denise, Pre Prepper Mom. Are you new, Prepper Mom, or am I just not recognizing? Michelle, FDR, Joanne, Alex, Alexandra, Josephine. You guys, thank you so much for coming at the spur of the moment. I I'm telling you. We have, I have so much stuff here that, you know how I usually get ready and I put things in lots? I didn't even do that this time. I got so much stuff, I can just grab it. And it's all variety and it's all different. If you've seen the last video Wade put up of him and Ashley, you might have a heads up on some of it. But anyway, I, oh, Debbie's here. Melissa. You know, I stop everything to say hi if I see someone. And I know Ed's here. I saw Ed, or did I mistake Edie for Ed? Oh, I did. I saw Edie and thought it was Ed. My mom. <laughs> I'll tell you what, things are rough right now. My mom's having an emergency pacemaker put in on next Friday. Hers quit working. That's why she's been so weak. I thought she was weak because of dad. But anyway, that uh, everything's we're, we're working on getting them all fixed. Yes, we are. And it's been rough, but I am back. And um, you don't want me sitting here crying, so I'm not going to go into it too deep. <laughs> No, boy, wouldn't that be a rain kill or a buzz kill? 
Why did I say rain? It's so sunny and nice out today. All right. I'll tell you what the problem is. We just left from having lunch with a couple of our church friends. And um, we are so full of um, fish and chips. So I am so full <laughs> that I probably won't make sense for a little while. But I'll try. Okay. Now, did I miss anybody? Now, for the new people out there, I want to run over uh, real quick, you know, how to do this. But also, for the new people, if I'm busy doing something, this chat is the best in all of auctions. And they would easily help anybody. Every one of them would help anyone if they needed some help. So, don't hesitate. But I'm, you should be on live chat. Uh, at the top of the link, at the top of the chat, you see a, I pinned the link. Like I said, the first one is goes to my closet, and then you see the word or. The second one goes to Ricky's closet. We're doing the second one right now for, and I'll tell you when to stop doing that one. And um, so that's how we're going to do this for both of us today. Um, and if it's confusing, I'm sorry. But also, um, if there's a mistake, it's not a big deal. <laughs> we pretty much share anyway. So anyway, that's what we're going to do. If you're new, you just put your bid in. And remember, everybody's internet's completely different. And my stream yard is always slower than your any of your internets. That's just the way it's made. I wish they could figure that out. <laughs> Fix it. But they don't. Okay, so that's why I'm looking at my phone and you think I'm very rude because I don't look at the picture. It's because my phone, uh, T-Mobile works faster and I, I know what's going on more that way. So, let me see. It, uh, 0 to 50 is a $2 increments. After 50, it's $5 increments. There's Ed, he's here. Um, so we got Callie and we've got Ed. So we're covered in the monitor situation that, and Deborah. So everybody's here. That's wonderful. I love that. All right, you guys. I'm trying to read the chat real quick and not look like I'm <laughs> fish and chips were so good. You know, we went to the red Robin. I haven't been there in years and they really give you a lot. Ricky and I shared it and we're both stuffed and, and she has a takeout box and that was one meal. So you get your money's worth there. I'll tell you, it was nice. So, all right, you guys. Oh, I, <laughs> I was, I forgot I was working on him. I got somebody up here. I'll let you, uh, we're going to go with him first. All right. He's already sitting here. So here we go, folks. Here we go. Remember uh, that and we're going to go with the second one, Foxy Roxy Venture, for payments until, um, oh, that, that reminds me. I've got a, I got a list from there, so the labels come out right. Yeah, this is, this is an experiment. Let's see how it works. <laughs> I'm sure it'll work great. Aren't you? Are you guys worried? All right. There's a big gold man sitting over here. And he, he is big, and I got him halfway dusted off. Before I ship him, he will be fully dusted off. But he's, he's heavy. He doesn't seem to have any uh, chips or cracks. And he's gold. He's the golden man. Here we go. Let's start him at 20. And let me see how big he is. You know what? I got to tell you guys something. Wade is having so much fun torturing me right now. And he tortured Ricky. That he has this mannequin that it's from the chest up. And he has the meanest looking face of any mannequin I've ever seen. And he looks like a midget for the longest time because he was by the front door on the floor. Well, Ricky and I came in late because we got stuck in a detour a very long detour last night and so we got home pretty late and we opened the door and that man was 
up high on boxes and he scared me to death. I screamed. We woke up the house. Anyway, I've never seen a mannequin look so mean in my life. I ne I'm going to have to take a picture of him and share it with you guys. And I liked him better when he looked like a midget, but now he's tall and looks like a full grown man. And in the dark, it's scary. So anyway, yes, this is $20. We're starting this. Who is, wonder who he's supposed to be? He looks like a G.I. Joe man with a meanest face. And I'm going to have to take a picture of him and show you guys. I will do that. Yeah, will you go take a picture of the man? Try to get, you know. Yeah, when he's on the floor, he looks like a mean midget. But Wade put him on boxes. So when I opened the door, he looked like a six foot something man in the dark. And even if I knew he was there, his face would scare me. But it, I didn't realize he was going to be there. <laughs> no, he's not for boxing. If somebody would box him, I'd be happy. He's clay. I think he would um, crumble. But we did knock him over just a few minutes ago coming in, and he didn't break. So who knows? But Wade's having fun with him. But, you know, he's only going to be able to scare me so many times with it. And I think that I think we've hit the limit on that. But anyway, uh, Wade's having an auction again tomorrow I, and after mine. I think his is at one or two. So I just wanted to let you know. Wade showed us. Oh, did he already tell you the story? Oh, my gosh. He's having too much fun with this mean looking guy. But anyway, I we're going to go $20 on this big. Let me measure him. I'll tell you, this guy's beautiful compared to the other one. This one I like. This one is Hey, he's 17 and a quarter inches tall. Let's see how wide he is. He is 9 inches wide. I think he'd be cute in a yard, a garden outside even. Oh, you guys knew that, huh? <laughs> Debbie, <laughs> no warning. Gmail, grandmavengers at gmail.com. Warn me, you guys. <laughs> All right. So, um, now we we can set this aside. There's no, uh, oh, I think she's got a picture of the guy now. Let me see. Well, we got him with or without sunglasses. Well, I want him to see his mean-looking eyes, Axel. and then we'll show him the sunglasses. Yeah. Axel had put the glasses on him. There's the mean-looking man. I guess he is now, where's glasses. the sunglasses? I'll let you do your photo. Oh, there he is with sunglasses. I do prefer him with sunglasses. Axel's put it on. Axel did that. Thank Axel for disguising the man. <laughs> <laughs> All right. And I guess you do put him on a post or something and boxing oh he is a boxing yeah, thing yeah I, I almost feel like doing that <laughs> I, i'm i'm feeling aggression towards that man <laughs> oh my gosh i now that i know he's for boxing i can get all my nerves out that'd be good to have him for that because i definitely would like to box him i'm teasing you guys i don't box <laughs> but he is scary looking and add in the dark you know in the dark with that scary man but anyway, um, kick him. <laughs> I'll kickboxing. Wade says he likes kickboxing. He couldn't complain that I want to try, you know. <laughs> All right. Is anyone in this into this one, the golden man? Or should we set him aside and start with something else? The golden man. I like him for yards. I love little statues. Well, this isn't quite a little one, but. I love statues in gardens and in backyards and stuff, but we're going to pass on this and he will be on one of our Poshmarks. There's three Poshmarks. There's Ashley Wade Ventures because Wade made it that way because he, when Poshmark first started, he thought it was more for women, but it is for everybody now. Then there's Foxy Roxy Venture without an S. And then there is Grandma Ventures, and there is, this item is electronically pro protected. 
So if you went into a store and you tried to walk out with this big guy, which I can't imagine somebody wouldn't notice, it had an alarm on it. <laughs> so he must be special, right? So that's the only markings I can see, Debbie. So I'm going to set him aside. He will be on one of the three posh marks. Because we're adding Ricky to the Venture family. <laughs> All right. Let me see here. We have... Oh! Oh! Oh, we have somebody interested in the golden man. All right, let me take a picture and I'll be right back. I'm waiting. You see, guys, the internet's a little slow. Uh, everybody's is different. It's not your fault. It, yeah. <laughs> see, she sticks up for me. It's not my fault. <laughs> Thank you, Ricky. You're welcome. So loyal. <laughs> All right, let me take a picture of him and we'll be right back. But I need to get on. Uh, you want to use my yeah, I need your phone to do your stuff. Okay. Well. Bear with us, folks. Bear with us. I'm, we're trying something a little different. Uh, can you put it on your Poshmark real quick? Oh. So I can take a pictures on your Poshmark. Whoa. Did you get it? Uh, no. Well, I got it on camera for you. Oh, I want it on just the Poshmark oh, camera. Oh, I got it. Okay, sorry. Uh, no, that's okay, Ricky. I And I don't know your code. I almost, we, we need the same code, don't we? <laughs> oh, I, it recognizes my face. But. Oh, okay. Okay. Just go in your Poshmark app. And I will go from there if you get me in the app. Okay. Is that, oh, you did it. She did it. I'm so <laughs> proud. <laughs> there we go let's get him in the light a little more i love this guy this guy's cool looking all right okay give me a minute i'm gonna put him online and you guys we can can figure out what what what's gonna happen here oh man we're in tight quarters here today we, we got so much stuff <laughs> all right why does he want to wipe him down? All right, thank I you. Could, actually, I could probably get over there now. No, Ricky, it's okay. 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 When when I box him up, he'll be shiny. Shiny. All right. All right. This is going good. All right. Just a second here. I know I keep saying that, but I don't say it as good as Matthew McConaughey does. <laughs> I always like how he says things. Oh gosh, I I don't know your phone. All right. Oh, what's that? It's okay. I'll be. Uh, it's all right. I'll just have to have you fix it. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna put gold, seventeen inch man, and he's really heavy, which is nice because uh, I feel like that makes him stronger. Yeah, somehow I screwed up here, but I got it fixed. I got it fixed. I actually... See, Ricky and I are complete opposites when it comes to phones. Hers is cluttered with everything probably for the last 20 years. And yeah, mine, I delete things, and I wish to wouldn't them because I keep it so clean. So that's not good for me. But she could find anything. I did find it. Easy to uh, easier way to delete my messages or my emails. All right, let, them all erased, I'm messages. gonna switch back to my phone. Yeah. All right. Oh, where's Susie? Oh darn it! I don't believe I didn't get Susie out. There she is. All right. See, I told you guys where I'm a little unorganized, but uh, Alexis at twenty. I think, is Alexis the only one um, still in here? So we're going to say going once slowly. And actually, I'm going to say going twice slowly because I think she might be the only one. It doesn't have any markings. I looked. 
<laughs> Ed blames everything on Wade. He's loyal too. All right. Um, sold to Alexis for $20. Congratulations, Alexis. Con now, remember, I hope I don't bug you guys by re reminding you this. At the top of the link, there's Grandma Ventures. And then the second one is Rox Foxy Roxy Venture. That's the one we're using now. Foxy Roxy Ventures. That's the site it will go to and that's the one we're paying on now and we're going to keep it that way for a while and then i'll switch it over to mine so i hope that isn't too confusing i have my link and then it says or and i have her link so sold sold for twenty dollars let me get it up there for her for you for us all 20 bucks that's a good buy on that and i do think you're gonna like it I like it. If you have your own yard. If I yeah. <laughs> I need my own yard. I'll have it next year. Okay, just a minute here. Uh, oh, dear. Okay, it's on there. Oh, it's up there. It's on Foxy Roxy Venture. The second link. And it's up there ready to go, Alexis. There you go. Carla, hello. I hadn't said hello to you yet. And uh, my monitors are really good at helping. So Susie says, congratulations. You know what, you guys? I have to find a gavel for Ricky. I want to find a funny one. <laughs> no, <laughs> I'll find her a real one. All right. Here we go. Right now, we've got one, two, three um, plus size. This is from Crazy Cat. It is 2628. I think that is a, a plus 3X. It is so cute. It's It looks like it's hardly been worn. I can't see any wear on it, to tell you the truth. There's that one. They were my sister's. That's a and one size fits all. This is one size that fits all, but I me it's measured against the 3X. And so it's really nice. And it's part cotton, part polyester. And it's really nice, a uh, heavy uh, t-shirt. It's not, it's not that flimsy t-shirt. And it has a V-neck. And it's got the good length that we all like. Yeah. Then we have, I love paisley. Paisley pattern. We're going to start these this lot at $15. Ed, Ed has... <laughs> Ed wants me to get Wade's gavel for you. Oh. <laughs> but then Ricky's gavel would be bigger than mine. <laughs> and that. I think mine's special. <laughs> All right. So a 3X beautiful Paisley blouse that would look wonderful with jeans. So we're starting this lot at $15. $15. You know what we're going to throw in with this? We're going to be creative. We're going to throw in these three candles with it. They're the kind that there's no fire they take the batteries so you have three candles and they they're in good shape so we're going to have three shirts and then we're going to get all dressed up and we're going to have atmosphere here's our atmosphere so we're going to start it at 15 dollars. that's a good that's a good amount for all of this i hope so do we have any interest and if we do i'll take a picture Oh, I need air conditioning. <laughs> this is lot number two. It is 3X in size. 3X. And then the candles, I will... Am I yelling, folks? I feel like I'm yelling. Am I yelling at you guys? It's 8 inches by 8 inches, but one's thicker than the other. And then we have our little 4-inch, but it's wider than...
Did you stay up late last night, Ed? Okay, we got three, three, three X. They don't even look like they've been worn, but they might have been worn once. And then we have the three candles that you put little batteries in and you don't have to worry about the flames catching anything on fire. Now, if there's uh, no interest, we'll kind of wait a minute. If there's no interest, then um, <laughs> Ed, I don't want to get you going on the sleeping thing because um, that is... We could talk all day on that. <laughs> yeah, I was including you. <laughs> all right. Are we going to pass? Or do you want, somebody want this bargain starting at $15? And it's okay if you pass. We'll just, Ricky will put this on her Poshmark. So I'm going to fold it up and set it aside and grab something else. Unless you guys say stop. <laughs> stop. We really do want it. Oh, dear. That's, I'm talking in Wade's high voice. He does that because he says I sound that way. But you guys know I don't. But he's done that since he was like six years old. He's imitated me. He'd get me laughing so hard I... I feel like I was going to have to wet my pants sometimes walking to the store because he liked to walk to the store when he was that age. And he'd get me laughing so hard, imitating me. And what's so bad about it is he did it so well. And I realized how silly I must really look sometimes. All right, we're going to pass on this. I don't see anybody uh, grabbing it. So this will go on uh, Ricky's. Foxy Roxy Poshmark. And she'll do the candles separate than the clothes. And I gotta set this somewhere. And I'll do it right here. And Ozzy, no grabbing. No grabbing. All right. All right. Thank you. Let me check for your gold man. I'm sure it's fine. What are you going to name your gold man? Yes, you did. Everything went through perfectly. Uh, you're, I have to tell you, uh, Alexis, you are Ricky's very first customer in Poshmark. And, and she's saying thank you. And because of that, because of that, we are going to throw in a special present for the gold man and you being Ricky's first customer. So that is great. Thank you. Now, I'm going to show you what's in this box. And we're going to start this at $15. Thank you guys so much. Hi, Patricia. I'm glad you could make it. I love it when I see you guys that haven't been here for a while show up. I do love that. You know, we're going to start this at $10. That's what we're going to do. And now let me show you what I've got here. Uh, what Ricky has here. I'm doing it for her today. She's in, <laughs> she's in training, but I'm going to have to be careful because I think she would stay in training for a long time. Years from now, you're going to see me training her. All right. No problem, Alexis. I'm just glad you're back. I love having everybody show up. It makes me feel good. All right. Let me show you all of this. And this is all for your hair. There is tons of hair ties, all different kinds, all different, all different materials, all different colors. This is jam packed full. This is jam packed full. And again, all different kinds, all different colors. I didn't count these. Ooh, ooh. Look at this cool purple one. There's a lot of them that kind of look like that. But these are just tons and tons of hair ties and I, if no one buys this 
Ricky might have to gift me. <laughs> no, I'm teasing. I would not let her do that. Uh, we're arguing on, we're going to argue in front of our people. <laughs> I look at all those different colors. I mean, there's a lot of colors. There's one, two, three, four, five stuff full bags. Then there's all these clips and barrettes full of clips and barrettes. Here's some more barrettes. Lots of barrettes. Here's some little tiny black tie uh, hair ties. Here's a whole bunch of brand new hair ties, all different colors, the thin kind. There's everything here. So you're getting one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine bags of stuff. Now I'm going to take a picture because we got a Lexus for $12. We're looking for $14. This will also be the Foxy Roxy. And uh, I will take a picture and I'll be right back. Oh, you didn't take your phone, did you? No, I don't. Okay, I see it. Oh, dear, Ricky. You want my password? I'm going to have to have your password. Yeah. Six, three. You're giving it to everybody. Oh, yeah. That's all right. <laughs> Six, three. Zero, two. Well, that's, there's two more numbers. Oh, zero, zero. Oh, all right, I'm good. You might have to repeat it every time, but <laughs> yeah, <laughs> she's she's getting out of that. All right, all right. Let me put this up there, and I'll be right back while you guys figure this out. Let me get you a pen and paper. So, yeah, we didn't think this out all the way, did we? <laughs> I never think anything all the way. <laughs> well, I like to think I do, but I really do know that I don't. Here, just write it on there. They're okay. recalling my car. Anyway, let me put this up there. How many bags did I say there was? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine bags. My chair is sliding all over. Ugh. Nine bags of hair ties. I love hair ties too. I really do. I use them all the time because I, I don't like my hair by my face anymore. I've changed. All right. Okay, let me see where we're at. I'm using two phones, two computers. And it's working somehow. What am I looking for? Oh, YouTube. All right. All right, we got a Lexus at 20, so we're looking for 22. And I'm going to show them again and set them in the box. They're, I mean, it is jam-packed full, and there's tons of colors. Some of the colors are even in the middle, but I do love this. This is another one I like. I go for the purples. Can you tell? <laughs> Ricky's that way too. We, we love purple. There we go. This is her first auction. And you guys are so great. So there's three in there. And we got, I love the black. I love the, I love the burg. Is that yeah. burgundy? Yeah. yeah. So let me see where we're at. We got Edie at 22. We're looking for Callie. I hope you don't get kicked off. Why would you get kicked off? We got Alexis at 24. We're looking for 26. I like the barrettes too. And there's matching barrettes in here so you can wear them, you know, sizes. and different sizes. And the, the old standbys I love. This is a good group. Good group. And a couple extra ones. Are those for me? <laughs> no. <laughs> I'm teasing you guys. A lot of nice colors. Hello, Patricia. All right. We're going once. Alexis at 24. And we're doing it slowly until there's only one person standing. 
and there is a lot of nice colors in here. Big variety. Big variety. You could even, if you got a bunch of girls in your family, you could give each one of them a bag and they'd be happy because there's a lot of colors in each bag. Going once. I didn't know that did that, Callie. I'm, I'm, I never had that happen, so I don't know how to explain that. I think we need a tech wizard because that isn't me. <laughs> Going twice, Ed says. And Ed's going to do his last chance before we say going three times. <laughs> I, I love the last chance. What's that? He gives them like, instead of saying four times, he gives them a last chance. So they actually get four times. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> there must be some little glitch, that, glitch there, Callie. I don't, I just, if anybody knows how to help her with that. Oh, also you guys. Always put your channels in the chat. I'm trying to remind you guys each time because I didn't even realize Callie had, had one until she mentioned it. And another thing is when you go on our websites, um, a Poshmark sites, mine and Foxy Roxy, um, sold, sold to Alexis for $24. Congratulations. You always can bundle if it's not an auction. And you can uh, make offers. So just remember that because we want our customers to give themselves a discount. So I'm going to put that up there for $24. Here we go. This is going pretty good. I, I am pleasantly surprised. It is up there, Alexis. It's up there. Okay, what? Which of us do not like purses? I that I bet. I don't know. Maybe Ed. I'm not sure. I've got. Let me see how many purses here. You want to do them all at once, or you want me to split them up? Whatever you want to do. Should we do them all at once? Yeah. Okay. I have got. I love this purse. It's called Big B U D D H A. And the handle does have a little wear and tear. The where is that? Where? Let me see. Right here, I think. Oh, that I think it's fine. Oh, okay. Well, this is a very pretty color. Look, and yet the color's coming on uh, pretty uh, close to it. It's a very pretty color. It's nowhere on the, it's looking very nice. Now, what I like about this one is it has this pocket and you can zip it separately. It has the middle with pockets. Then it has another pocket that you can separate, you can zip up um, separately. None of the gold's worn on it. So you get this one. Then you get this black. This could be a crossbody. I think it's a crossbody. Yeah. And then this unsnaps and you and can put your credit cards. In this unsnaps. Yeah. And you've got a credit card area. you got a zippered up area. You've got a pocket in this area that zips up, zips up separately. You've got a middle area that snaps. And then you've got a zippered area in the other area that, that zippers up. <laughs> and that's very little used. And it's hardly used at all. Yeah. And it, what's the name brand on it? I'm not seeing a name brand, but it is an awful cute oh, crossbody. So mind. there's two. We're going to start them at $20. Oh, Ed, I like your starting bid better, $201. But Ooh. I think everybody would leave us. <laughs> Actually, there's four purses. So there's this two. Now we got our navy. We got a, none of these. These are Ricky's, um, her purses. And she's hardly used them because she went to a little tiny style purse. Because I couldn't carry them anymore. Because she didn't want to carry these big purses anymore. So you got zipper, zipper, 
cloth, two sides that completely have their own zippers, another zipper, and on the back a zipper. This one is that brand. Okay. And there's no way I can pronounce that. But it's soft. It feels like real leather. I don't remember. I just had to put it's a real on. soft. I'm not 100% sure, but it feels real, Ricky. Yeah. Why didn't I look at these before we <laughs> Okay, we got so we got the real pretty uh, kind of a light teal, a black and a blue. And we got somebody at 20, but we got one more purse. This I'm adding one more. For anybody that likes a suitcase. <laughs> so this one can be suitcase or purse. It's a little bigger. It has the shoulder straps. That's very adjustable. So it could be crossbody. It used. has hardly used. She didn't if she didn't use. Okay, let's start on the back. Here's the back. Here's one pocket that zips up by itself. Inside this middle pocket that zips up. We have an open pocket, a zip-up pocket. That's the middle. Two open, open pockets. Yeah. Two open pockets. And then we have the inside. Uh -oh. It does have a little pink in this one, but it doesn't kill it. It doesn't hurt it. Then what I like is the... It's a good size. You know, it has these... What I use those for was I have a pin on hand. Oh, for a pin. Or a pencil or whatever. All right. That's there. What I did. And then you got this decorative snap pocket. This is hardly used because Ricky wouldn't use a big purse, and it is in great condition. I love it. Very cute. Does it smell like a cow? <laughs> the, the bunny thinks a you know, I do have something I could talk about that smells, <laughs> but I'm not going to. <laughs> I wish I could, but I think... Uh, I think that would not be nice. It isn't a person. I'm not saying a person smells. No. None of these purses smell. Ricky hardly used them. They were her personal purses. I was trying to find something that was compatible with my neck. You got a neutral tan. You got a beautiful blue. You got your black crossbody. And you got your really pretty kind of spring looking light teal, I think. So that's what we got. But um, I'm going to take a picture. We got Edie at 20. We're looking for 22. You want me to hold them? No, it's fine. Oh, I got to use your phone. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 6302. All right. Zero, zero. All righty. All right. I'm taking a picture of the pile. And I'll be right back and we'll figure out who is going to have a whole wardrobe of purses. Because that's literally what it is with the variety of color. All righty. Alexis, I got both your payments. Thank you very much. So, lot three. Four slightly used purses. You wouldn't know they're used. Because Ricky coordinates everything by color. So everything doesn't get a lot of use. <laughs> <laughs> and I never realized that until my husband said I I matched all the way down to my underwear. <laughs> yeah, but we're not going to show him that. <laughs> yeah, no. <laughs> Lot three is purses, and there's four different colors. I just do everything on home accents, decor, real quick, like, you know, because... Uh, have to get to another laptop? No, we'll, we'll figure it out, right? Okay. We'll figure it out. All right. We've got Denise at 22, and we're looking for 24. Where'd Susie go? Oh, no. Oh, here she is. 
I stuck her in a box once, but I found her before I shipped the box. <laughs> but everybody's agreed they'll send her back if they find her. I should test them. I should stick it in one of the boxes and see if I get her back because I know I will. Wouldn't that be fun? I could loan her out to everybody. They could hold Susie and then send her back. <laughs> I don't know if you guys would like that or not. Anyway, we got Denise at 22. Edie's out. So let me see. Was it just Edie and Denise or was it um, anyone else? All right, we're going once. Callie said she'd keep Susie. Oh. Oh. To hold her hostage. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Callie will hold her a hostage. Shall I send a back box of fabric? That's yeah. what she'd do. <laughs> I bet if I entice you with fabric, Callie, you'd send her back. All right. We got Denise going. We got Denise going. I, I think we should sell this, you guys. Sold. Sold to Denise for $22. That's a good deal, Denise. That's really a good deal. All right, it's up there. It's up there. All right, I'll let you grab these. I want you guys to know that today's Saturday, Monday morning, first thing, everything will be shipped. And that I will promise you. I'm going to I'm going to help her. So, congratulations. Anywhere on anywhere Oh, Denise, you know, not only do we have the same name, your birthday's next weekend. We're in the same birthday month. Mine was the 10th, and uh, yours is, I don't know what next weekend is, but I will definitely check. So, happy birthday, Denise. That's wonderful. I'm glad. And I, there are three different good colors that will go with lots of things. All right. What do we have next? Where do I put this? Anywhere. Okay. On the bed? <laughs> on the okay. corner of the bed would be okay. That last day, I think the only other thing yeah, I brought. I, that will, yeah. I don't know. Who, who loves lead crystal? Oh. Who loves lead crystal? Let's see. This is the heaviest little, ooh, and the stopper is all glass. It is lead crystal. It's very heavy. It's a cute little, like a pot belly design. It has the cut in the glass on the bottom and then the indentation. And it, it we're going to start this at, I'm going to start this at $15. It is a really, really nice one. It's got clear lead crystal. And I love the pure, uh, the glass, the stopper is all glass. We'll start it at $15. And, oh, and remember... I know I'm saying this a lot, but we're doing the second link in the top that says Foxy Roxy Venture. We I tried everything to help her get a name that had an S on it, but we didn't want to get rid of little Foxy Roxy. <laughs> and wait till you see her. She's so cute. So anyway, um, we're going to start this at 15. Now, should I add something to it? I'm going to add those candles to it because oh. if you're drinking Kahlua, because I'm imagining Kahlua in here, <laughs> then we would need atmosphere. And we got atmosphere. I was thinking more like a sugar bowl. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> we got atmosphere. That we can put in one of your totes over there okay. for later. We need to list that. Okay. Just keep it all separate for you. All right, so you got atmosphere, you got lead crystal. We're starting at fifteen dollars, and magic. There you go. I knew there was a place for that. And 
you know what? I'm going to add another thing to this. So we get this candle holder because it kind of looks cool with this. Then you get the other two candles. So you get all of this starting at $15. Do I have anyone interested in my little thing I put together here for you? Well, you know what? We'll just put this on Poshmark and we'll hold it. And while I'm moving it away, if somebody's interested, go ahead and... I'm not sure what that means. Okay, I'm going to set this aside. And if somebody is interested, they can... Let me know. Now we got some handmade. All right. You know, I want to ask you guys something. Is in if you're into antiques, I wonder if you'd be into this. It's our last one that we have. I I'm popping this out there. I wasn't planning on to, but I am. All right. What is it? It's our last antique. Yeah, Ozzy's here. He likes waffles. It's our antique double waffle maker. It does need a little cleaning, but it will clean right up. I'm just, it has its original cord. And it's in perfect usable shape. So is anyone interested in an antique waffle maker? It's deco. It does, it's a deco that works. <laughs> it works. It, you can do one or two. You've got the original cord. The cord is not torn apart or have any problems. It's a perfect cord, other than it's old like me. So anyway, we're gonna start this at I'll start it at uh, $20. It's actually um, very collectible. So, is anyone interested in this waffle maker? And if not, that's okay because you know where it's going to go. It's going to go right on our Poshmark if you change your mind. Okay, Edie's interested. Let me take a picture with her phone, not mine, and I'll be right back. Okay, that is six three on it. Okay, I'm taking I'll be right back. I'm gonna put it online and then we'll finish up and see where we're at with it. I'm telling you, we had so many of these, they all sold. I mean, we had like 75 or more of them. Uh, and this is the very last antique waffle maker that Wade and I have in this house I told you guys we have so much stuff here that I'm just grabbing I'm just grabbing stuff and showing it to you so there's going to be stuff you're not going to want. There's going to be quirky. There's going to be weird. There's going to be great. There's going to be everything. I know I'm talking fast, but I just want to get a lot done for everybody today. I don't know what lot I'm on. I've already lost count, so I'm going to say four. <laughs> but you know you go by the pictures, not my lot numbers. I don't even know why I use them. But anyway, I do. This is an antique. It's not vintage, it's antique. Waffle maker. Dual waffle maker. With a cord that works and it's in good, good shape.
Okay, let me see where I'm at. Switch phones. I might have to buy another phone. I'm kind of liking this. Sonia, hello. Oh my gosh, you're from Australia. You're on my bucket list too. I really would love to go there, but I, I'm not going to sneak my, my bird in because I found out that uh, you get in trouble for sneaking dogs and animals in there. So, yeah, but you won't be able to take Foxy Roxy. All right, we've got uh, Edie at 20. So we're looking for 22. You know, I don't eat waffles very often, but every once in a while, they just sound so great, don't they? I I believe they're better than pancakes myself. Well, Sonia, if I ever get over there, <laughs> I will take you up on that. All right, you guys. We've got Edie at 20. We're looking for 22. We're going once. We're going to slowly... Uh, I don't think anyone else is interested, so we're going to, uh, we're going to, we're going to, we're going to go slowly at twice. Grilled cheese in a waffle maker is fantastic. I like that even better than waffles. That sounds so good with tomato soup, right, FDR? <laughs> tomato soup with grilled cheese. If I wasn't so full, I'd think about that for dinner. But I don't know if I'll be able to eat dinner today. All right. You know what? Let's just sell this. I don't think anyone else is bidding against her. Paula, hello. I almost missed that. I'm sorry. I try not to miss anybody. Hello. All right. We're going to sell it. It's sold. It's sold to Edie for $20. Edie, you got a great deal, and I hope you love it, and I hope you use it. But it even just looks good sitting in a kitchen. It's Art Deco. There we go. All right. I, I want to make sure. All right, I got it up there. Now, uh, I forgot who bought the purses. Oh, yes. If you're having a problem, let me know, and I'll try to work that out. Congratulations, Edie. But don't worry. if it takes. Sometimes Poshmark takes a minute, and if it does take a minute, that's okay, because I, if, I, uh, if anyone bought it out from under you, I would explain to them the problem, and you would still have it. So, Ricky, yeah. oh, <laughs> I think you're trying to take a nap without me no, knowing it. My just oh, just okay, I'll set this over here. Oh, oh. I got No, I got a spot for it, Rick. Don't worry about it. You're fine. You're fine. That's okay. Okay. Now, this is handcrafted. Did Randy make this? No. I don't remember. She told me somebody. We're going to start it at 10. Yeah, that's fine because it's got missing beads. We're going to start this. It's you a lampshade. Hide it in the back. <laughs> it's a lampshade, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. A hanging one. I don't know how you can. Oh, Denise. Yeah, that's right. Okay, Denise, if you have any problems, um, let me know. But don't worry about it. You'll get them. I'm not going to, especially because you want them for your birthday. I mean, I would never let that happen okay this is a handcrafted lampshade it's handmade or just decoration hang up or decoration <laughs> you can just hang it somewhere just a minute let me see some of them i got twisted up here looks like what well, really it there's one area it looks like there might be some beads missing, but it doesn't act, it doesn't look bad. It can be in the back. We're starting this at $10. It is, uh, it's kind of, it's vintage. And it's beautiful. So, do we have any interest in this for $10? 
Did I put that up there? Yeah, I did. Okay. Yes, I did. All right. I'm going to grab a drink real quick. Starting bid $10. Are we passing and putting it on Poshmark? Or does somebody want this handcrafted lampshade or decoration? It is vintage. Am I making you guys dizzy? I'm putting you to sleep. <laughs> You're okay. I can do this. You can rest. I just had to try to lay down from the stomach. Okay. You guys are being so good to Ricky today. Thank you. I appreciate that. I'm trying to get her to work. I want her to get busy. <laughs> I want her to get busy. I appreciate it. There's four purses, Denise. There's four of them. There's um, the the spring-looking light teal, the black, the blue, and the tan. And if I put three, that's crazy. I I didn't mean to. I can fix it. But there's definitely four. I would never. I I don't ever go back and do that. There's four, and I can fix. I'll fix it. But, uh, yeah, I, no, no, you misunderstood. Lot three. That means it was the third, uh, third sale of the day. Lot three. That wasn't the amount of purses. I think I put four purses in the, in the, um, description. So there's four purses. Lot three, the third third sale of the day. We're gonna pass on the on the lampshade, and that is perfectly okay. She will put it on our website if anybody changes their mind. Okay, where am I going now? You know what? I don't have to look far. I think this is cool. I'm going right here. I like this. Oh my gosh. We're going to start this at, uh, let me see how much I can dig up right here. Oh my gosh. I... Okay. All righty. This will be lot number. What lot number am I on? Let me see. One, two, three, four. This is lot number five. And we're going to start this at $10. Now, these are natural wood. They're very pretty. They have the, the places where you can hang them up on your wall. They have... Uh, all these hooks. Can I keep one of these? Which one do you want? I just want they're all the same, I think. Yeah. Just one of them. Oh, I didn't know you wanted one. I was waiting to. Oh. <laughs> I put my, my okay, one. Ricky. Ricky took one. <laughs> so you have one, two, three, four, five. These have uh, there's um three of them that have all these hooks. They are natural wood. They look sealed. And then they, they have the wall hangings. So there's three of them with a lot of hooks. Then there's two of them with two hooks, which you could either add more or use it that way. Looks like that would hold a sign or something. And there's two of those. Then there's three, three of these. And they have where they stick on the walls. And there's three with the, you know, remember the antique doorknob? That's what they look like. And there's three of those. They look pretty hanging jewelry or anything. So, what? 
Yeah, she wants to hang her necklaces up on hers. So we're starting at ten dollars, and this is kind of cool. I like these. the The wood is beautiful. It is solid wood, and it looks like it's been sealed. And then you have like those vintage doorknob hooks. That would be pretty hanging stuff. We got Melissa at ten dollars. I'm going to take a picture, and I'll be right back. Okay. Whoops. Oh, I covered up the number. Oh, there it is. All right. You'd think I'd remember it by now. Oh, there. Yeah, but I got it wrote down, so okay. I'm saved. You saved me. So I'm going to get a picture of all of it. Oh, dear, I did something wrong here. Just a minute. Okay, I'll be right back. So, everything's working out. We got Melissa at 10. We're looking for 12. Okay, all the payments are caught up. They always are. I don't know why I even say that, but I, I hear other auctioneers say that. <laughs> I'm, I'm not quite as professional. Okay, let me put this up there, and then I'll be right back. Just down to earth. Huh? You're just down to earth. <laughs> Is that what I am? Yep. <laughs> I'm not fancy either. Okay, do you remember what lot I said this was? Five. Okay. I'm listening. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I have a, I struggle with lot numbers. How many did I say? There's uh one, two, three, four, five wood, and then the doorknobs are three. So that's eight. Eight hangers. Five wood and three crystal doorknobs, I'm gonna say, because that's what they look like. Okay, I'm ready to see where we're at on that. We got Melissa at 10. They are necklace holders. That's what she's going to use hers for. Um, I don't think anyone else is going up against Melissa. So I think we should just sell this. Shall we say sold? Sold to Melissa for ten dollars. Congratulations, Melissa. You're gonna be you're gonna like these. That's a really good price, too. Yay, Melissa. Let me get it up there for you. You know what I want you to do, Ricky? Yeah. I want you to pick, you know, those big brass things? Uh-huh. Would you pick one and bring it here? I can do that. I'm to go for I want to surprise them with something nice and big. Oh, oh, that's funny. My mom says that about my dad all the time, taking over the TV. Congratulations. Hello, Paul. I have something really, really big right now. And I'm wondering how I'm going to show it, but we'll figure it out, won't we? I'm running out of room to put things. All right. Just see all three of those. <laughs> oh, no, there no, might no. be more. No, that's fine. Okay, we have something really big now. Really big. Now, oh, it, what it says, let me check it out. I might need my magnifying glass. I do need my magnifying glass. All right. Just give me a second here. I didn't have this prepared. This is a surprise attack. Uh, do you have any oil? Sometimes you put oil on it. I'm trying to see what the name of it is, but it's not. I thought it would be there, but it's not. 
it's not there. It's a metal. I thought it was brass, but it's not. Oh, okay. It won't even stand up there. It's a big, tall vase. There's the top of it. Hello. That didn't work. Didn't echo, did it? <laughs> it's a big, tall vase. It's metal with gold, and it's got a kind of a rustic look to it. And I'm going to measure it right now. It definitely doesn't fit in my little work area. So it is. And I'm using the measuring that isn't chewed off on the end. It is 27 inches long. Don't switch buckets or I won't be able to no, fall in. No. It's 27 inches long. It's metal. It's not extremely heavy, but it's not light. And so it's not, I don't think it's brass, but it has a rustic look to it. We're going to start it at $20. Oh, we already did start it at $20. And I forgot already. 27 inches long. So it's over two feet tall. This would be cool with it, dried flowers in it or anything in it. It'd be nice just sitting somewhere by itself. It's very large. So we're starting it at 20. Is there any interest in this? I wish I could stand it up. But you, you're getting the idea that it's really big, right? <laughs> Too big for my area. All right. I was thinking umbrella too. Yeah. Like a really cute old fashioned umbrella or maybe a modern. Watch out. He's going to bite you. He's protective of his cage. And he really bites hard. Yeah, I know. He doesn't bite when he's out. Only... I didn't think I had my arm that close. Oh, you, yeah. He can. You'd be surprised. He He'll friend. get you. You don't bite on the friend. No. Oh, he would bite. I know. That's why. Oh, he would. And he bit me once and it hurt bad. Yeah, that'd be but he only bites when he's protecting the cage. Mm -hmm. All right. All right. We're going to put this on hold. I mean, on pass. And then we can, uh, we can bring it back later. Or I could add something to it. What about, these are brass. These, this is a hammered pillar plate. A hammered pillar, pillar plate. And this one is from the World Market. And it's brass. But the, I'm trying, I want them to be able to see the colors. Yeah. But my, I'm going to have to replace my light, I think. So I'm adding these two things to it. So you're getting all three items for uh, $20 starting. Is there any interest in this? Because we can pass and grab something else. I'm not real organized because there's so much stuff in here that I'm just trying to grab things. And... Okay, we're going to pass on this. We're going to pass. There we go. I thought you said right away there was some. Uh -huh. What did I say? Well, I got it right in the beginning before you even had it up. You said somebody would get $20. No, yeah. I, I said uh, the starting bid is $20. Wow. World market, I like it too. So we'll put that somewhere. Oh. Will you hand me that, that wood carving right there on the end? Oh, the dog. I love him. I do too. All right. We're going to pass on what we had there. But now we got this wood carving. And I want to show you something about this. The way they carved this dog. He is so cute. He is really cute. But look at him. Uh, the wood has lots of knots in it. See the wood that has a knot there? There's a knot there. And he's carved, and then there, they have this there. But look how cute they did his mouth and nose. We're going to start him at $15. He is a carved 
what would you say? He's got the big ears. Yeah, I'm not sure. And there's another knot. I love the wood because it has knots in it. And I wish I had a... Uh, let me measure him. He's so cute. I could see him sitting anywhere. He could be a doorstop. He could be on a shelf. He could be anywhere. He's just really adorable. He's 11 and a half inches tall. And he, this way he is seven inches. And we'll start him. Um, what did I say? 15? I said $15. Oh, we got him carved at 20. $20. He is worth it. He's got special wood. And then when he ca they carved it, these are ridges. They're actually carved. And then they, it looks like they fired the outside of the ridge. So he's got, those are indentations. They're carved. It isn't just, uh, they chose special wood with knots. They carved it out and then they burnt the top of the, uh, it's really, really um, made nice. And it is handmade. Okay, thank you. you. You read my mind. Well, I was going to do it, but if you want to, <laughs> <laughs> I, I we didn't. I didn't have time to get this done last night. Get things dusted because um, they closed down the freeway, part of the freeway. We ended up on this. I don't know. It felt like an hour and a half detour, oh, but wow. I don't. I mean, it was it was it bad. Seemed, yeah, it seemed like. And then we had an early morning yeah. thing, so this. Is there any interest in this little puppy? He's really cute. And if not, we'll put him on Poshmark. Okay, we're going to pass on the puppy. You know, just the, the way they carved it alone makes it so unique. He's real, And he has no broken parts or anything. He's perfect. And then they burnt, you know, the, the raised part of the carving. But that's okay. We'll put him over here and we'll just add him to uh, to Poshmark. Alrighty. I don't know what's in those boxes. I know they're, um, they're um, that candlelight stuff. Oh, party light. Party light, yeah. But that's okay. I, I'll see what they are. Oh, this is, is it like a candle? Oops. Oh, this matches that. They match. Oops. But I'm not sure how they go together, but there is instructions, but you'd have to read it. There's instructions. Well, somehow it goes. I think it makes like a tree or something. Oh, I think it is a tree. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. there's three holes there. And then you put the candle holder. Oh, it is a tree. Yeah. And then it has the candle here where you can candle. All right. Let somehow. me. And there's two different sizes. There's this big one. But the lid keeps on. Why do they make us put things together? I mean, I okay. Once you get it in, it does go good. Uh, I'll get it, Rick. Oh, my God. Oh, and then at the bottom fits in into this. Oh. Yeah, I keep losing the one leg. Maybe we should pass on this. I don't know. We can't get it together, but somebody would be able to. Yeah, it's got to go together. It's just, it hasn't been opened or something. Oh, it's screwed? No. Yeah. It goes, slips into these little things yeah. on the bottom. Okay. There. Now, if you get it on the top. Oh, this is kind of cool. I do like it. Oh, yeah. There, I got it, guys. I got it. There's two of them. A big one and a small one. We're going to sell them together. And believe me, you guys probably would be able to put them together way easier than I am. I'm not mechanically inclined, I guess. We even had to load it. Oh, wait a minute. I did that wrong. Oh, dear. Yes, it is. You recognize it, don't you? Okay. Oh my gosh. What am I doing? 
Maybe I better not buy party light any have party light because yeah, it doesn't somehow once you get it together. All right, guys. All right. <laughs> I can do it. It's got the bullets to it too. Look at this. And then they have votives. Okay, we're gonna start this. It is party light at fifteen dollars. Does that help show it better? Try it. So they're trees. They're metal trees. Tammy, that was okay. It was no big deal. I didn't mind. I just wish I could have been home to help you, but I couldn't. So don't worry about that. And I haven't checked the on the giraffes yet i don't know if they sold or not but i will check and get back to you okay we're gonna sell these we're, we're gonna start them at 15 and we also gave a lesson on how to put them together <laughs> <laughs> so is there any interest they're metal brass there's a darker brass I have no idea, Tammy. I hadn't. I had to hurry home. I was a little bit late getting it started, but I will check afterwards, and I I know how to get a hold of you. I will definitely do that. But I I haven't got to check yet. So, are we going to pass on these, or would somebody like the heavy brass metal candle holders that are trees? And you know what? They don't have to be Christmas trees. These could be year-round trees. They really could. I'm trying to make it where you can see them better. I got so much stuff around me, I feel very unorganized. <laughs> I don't know how I get those hearts, but every once in a while, those hearts show up. I don't know if you guys are doing it or what. We're going to pass on these, and I will take them apart and put them in the box at another time. All right, there you go, Rick. The instructions are ones on the floor. Okay. And it has printed instructions, but we kind of muffled through it our own selves. Oh, where do I put them? All right, you guys, I was going to keep this. I really was, but I'm not. Look at this beautiful beveled edged mirror. It's got a lot of fingerprints on it, but it is so solid. It's not thin. It has the metal frame, on, you know, as you can see at the top, it has a, a chain to hang it by and it is a beautiful mirror we're starting at $20 and I'm telling you what this the metal on it's heavy and nice the mirror is not flimsy it has the thick beveled uh, like a half an inch beveled here it's solid and you can hang it and we're going to start it at $20. And I tried really hard to find a place to hang it. But I'm so full. So is there anyone interested in this um, beveled mirror? It's got a nice weight to it. It's all metal and glass and mirror. Am I batting zero here today? What's going on here? Let me see. What about a beveled metal mirror with a London metal and glass clock that takes batteries? What about these two items starting at $20? Is 
This has a rustic look to it, and so does the mirror uh, metal. Both items for $20, starting at $20 or whatever. How's that sound? Do we have anyone interested in this? And we'll throw in the brass hand-painted little bowl. So you're getting three items, and we're starting it at $20. I like the clock, too. I, But I think it kind of goes with the mirror. They both have the rustic gold look on the metal. When you see this mirror in person, you're going to find out. Those are my socks. Oh, they're yours? <laughs> yeah. Oh, okay. I can sell them. <laughs> they're my bag of socks. <laughs> I didn't have room in my drawer. Start selling your stuff. Yeah, that's all right. Anything you can think of. <laughs> okay, we're going to pass on this. All right. I'm telling you, the mirror is rich looking in person, the way it's beveled, and it's not showing up good here. And then we got the clock. So I'm gonna we're gonna pass on this. So I will not bring this out again today, but we will put it on Poshmark. Let me see what I can find now. It's not sold, so it can go anywhere in the unsold stuff. You know what? <sighs> I want to bring these hats out. Ricky, you're going to die when you see this hat. It's one like mine, and you wanted it. Oh, really? You want to see it real quick? Oh, no, I got those other two. Okay. I don't, I don't know what I'm going to do with them. <laughs> All right, we pass on. I have lots more china. I have lots more china. But I have, they're huge china sets. I'm going to do these mirrors, and then I have on my work desk over here, I haven't listed them yet, I have two lidded casseroles. They're completely different that I will bring out next. I love these hats. All right. I, I'm going to show you my favorite one first. It is 50% uh, polyester, 50% acrylic, and it's washable. It has uh, like a corduroy feel to it. Now, I think this is a man's hat, but I'm going to tell you, I love this hat. And I actually was thinking about keeping it. I think it looks great on women. And so, uh, and I love the little leather band. It is a leather band. This is not a cheap hat. Even though I don't have a price on it, the inside's wonderful. It's all perfect. And it has uh, a little string here for some reason. I'm not sure what the strings are for, but it's meant to be there. It's a beautiful, and it has a very soft Chanel feel to it. Then we have this straw hat. I think it's called Just E-A-B. Just Fab. Just fab is the name of this hat. It's 100% paper, not straw. And it's got the floppy. I bought one of these in Mexico when we went on our cruise. I loved it. I still have it. And I'm not getting rid of it. But I almost kept this one too. It's got no, it's in perfect condition. The band's in perfect condition. It looks like, I'm not even sure it's been worn. It's so clean. So we got these two hats. And we're going to start them at $20. And I'm telling you, I'm surprised I'm even showing them because I fell in love with both of them uh, the minute Wade showed them to me. I never used to wear hats, and now I'm really into them. <laughs> <laughs> so, in fact, coming home from the cruise, Ricky had like three in her head at once. Yeah. <laughs> Where did you find that? In the back, in a bucket? Oh, yeah. It's already it's already oh. listed. Oh. All the buckets are oh. my inventory. No, that's okay. You didn't know. Yeah, buckets are all oh. inventory. Oh, okay. Anyway, do we have anyone interested in these hats? 
twenty dollars starting for both of them, and that and one of them's worth. I paid more than that in Mexico for mine. <laughs> Callie likes hats too. Mm -hmm. I'm into hats. This one I really, really, really liked, but I like this one too. But I have one similar. Okay, we're gonna pass on this. Am I batting zero for you guys today? Is there a bunch of those? There's two of these there. Oh, three. There's another one. All right. I'm going to pass on the hats. They will be on my Poshmark or on my head. I'm not sure which yet. They might be on my head. All right. Let's see what this is. Whoa. Looks like it. There's two of them there. Oh, I was going to do some china. Okay. I think there's more than two here. I'll do this real quick. What's in here? Oh. Well, we're going to get rid of that. Oh, that's cool. I don't think we use that anymore. Oh, you can for whiteout. You're making a safe and I know, but I never type any. Oh, there's lots of little stuff in here. Well, killer. Oh, this is. Ki I'm going to leave it all with this. All right, mm. these are like new. They've never been used. All right, these these are cool. <laughs> yeah, I know, Gally. I'm I'm seriously seriously thinking about it. Look at these beautiful bags. They are cool. Um, I wish I could see better. Sophia from New York. Look at this makeup bag. It opens all the way up. It has it, it's not been used. It's got this netting, then the plastic, more plastic, and then this seals up. Then there's this one that matches, and it has that area, that area with satin like inside. I wonder if this is for jewelry and this is for makeup. Then it has this world market, ooh, like soft uh, velvet outside, and then it's inside, and it zips up, and it's real pretty soft and then it zips up and it's got its tag it's brand new then you got this and it has it's called uh, palo santo and it's like a little burlap bag that's brand new then these were in there this is a baby card to welcome a newborn and this is a wedding card so i'm not sure which came first but they needed both <laughs> anyway that's coming with it we're going to start this at $20. Oh. Okay. Denise, you're going for the bags, not the hats, right? And the cards. You want to know which one I love? I love this one the most. It's got little gold splatters. It's really pretty and soft. But I love these bags. I think one's jewelry and one's makeup. And it lays all out for you to see everything you've got. And they're really um, wash. They feel like they're a cloth that's washable. The bags. Okay, let me take a picture of them, and then I'll be right back. Do I have to have all this stuff off, or just what? What you doing? Taking this off. Um. You take your phone. Oh, here it is. I found it. <laughs> I found it. It's all right. Okay, I'll be right back. And there we go.
I think this is lot six. I'm guessing lot six. I'm going to put makeup bags, makeup jewelry bags, travel bags. Yeah. And then I'm going to put a uh, couple extra, couple extra items. I'm going to put new because I, I just think they are. So, all right, let me see where I'm at on my phone. We got Denise at 20 going once. Nah. I'm going to pass on that. Okay. That's how I do that. Yeah. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Here's a reason. I'm gonna stuff those back in here so they stay nice and don't get lost. I love the cards too. Um, the the bottle actually shakes; those things shake inside there. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Flutter. Denise, I can't do that on auctions because uh, the only way I get paid is to send them out. You know uh, how I'm doing them on auctions. The only uh, Bundling is only when it's not during an auction, and there's a, you know, it's just the kind of the way it works with Poshmark. So I wish I could, but I can't, or they won't acknowledge that I got it to you. It'll look like I didn't send it. I'm sorry, but anybody that searches our sites uh, without an auction. Always bundle it, but keep in mind if you're doing a lot of dishes that I get in trouble when I do like those three feet long heavy glass dishes ones, which I did in the beginning. And uh, I got strongly worded letters that that's not right. And <laughs> so uh, thank you, Debbie. All right. So we got Denise on this. Do we have anyone else? Paula, um, how do you see in the chat? You should be on live chat. I pinned uh, the link to Poshmark at the top of the chat. There's two this time. It's the first time I've done that. The first one is mine. And then it says, or, and then it says Foxy Roxy um, Venture, not with an S. That is Ricky's and she's, uh, she's what we're working on right now. And so um, anyway, we're doing Foxy Roxy right now. <laughs> <laughs> that's how, that's how you do it and it's free to sign up for Poshmark they take all different kinds of payments the shipping will be seven I think it's 767 or 68 but um anyway I do the best I can and uh, we got this and I think Denise is the only one so let's just go ahead and do it and get it done sold for twenty dollars Denise there you go congratulations let me get it up there <laughs> I'm going to wait a minute. Okay. All right. It is up there, Denise. Yes, it is. Let me make sure everything's fine. All right. Okay, here's what we're going to do now. I promised China. Now, I'm going to show you this piece of China, and it is very nice. It is bone China. And I want you to know that this design, I have a complete, huge set of china and it has everything gravy both sugar creamer every piece coffee cups dinner plates bread and butter the whole ball of wax that i'm going to put on poshmark but i'm putting the casserole on today it for somebody that might be wanting it so uh oh my gosh what did i do i i got stuff around here that it, <laughs> it's so bad so yeah. Oh, you'd like the beaded lampshade for 10, Paula? Okay. Uh, let me 
let me just stick it up there real quick for you before I do even do the china. Okay, I'll just do it right now. Let me take a picture and get it up there. We'll just get that out of the way. It is handmade and you will like it. The they whoever macro made this or it looks like it's a little bit crocheted too. Um, it is in really well done. Let me figure this out. No problem. Now the picture isn't gonna be of it hanging, but you know how my pictures are. You you're lucky that you get what you get because I'm I'm doing them so quickly because I want to make sure. Okay, let me put that up there for you real quick, and then we'll get back to the china. Okay. Yeah, that's. Yeah, she she was here when I showed oh, okay. it. Yeah. Is this a butter churn over here? No, I don't think that. No, it's something else. It's like a juicer or something it's uh huge it's like uh for like ice water or something i'm not sure oh, i see yeah that's cool i like it too yeah i'm gonna put handcrafted lampshade or it could just be a hanging uh whatever you want It's given to me as a lampshade, but I don't know how to work. Yeah, how to a bit a lot of my people are real crafty. Yeah. And that's ten dollars. Okay. All right, it is up there. It's up there. Okay. You're okay, um, Callie. Um, Paula wanted that lampshade. Okay. You know, that, that kind of stuff puts me right to sleep. It's kind of like a sleeping pill for me. <laughs> I buy it at the dollar store because I don't like real strong stuff. All right. This. Okay. Look at this casserole. The gold on it, there's not any of the gold worn off. And it does look like it's 22 karat gold. Now, what you guys can't see is this is all the gold too. And then it has the green branches. So on, I'm trying to get it to show the gold on here like it does here. And then it has, okay. It's a beautiful, this is, oh, you guys, you know I have a hard time pronouncing this. And you guys always put it in there for me. But I'm just going to show it to you. It's from Japan. It's Bone China. It's that one, the kind I don't pronounce right. And I don't think I ever will. So I have this. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to start this at 20. It's well worth it. There's nothing worn on here at all. There's The gold is just like if they just did it. It is vintage. It is, uh, you know, a vintage. It's called Andrea. It's number 5524 Japan. And look at the handles, how beautiful they are. They're all with the gold. Even the design, and I have a complete, I mean, I've never had so much complete china dishes as I have right over here that I have to get listed. And the reason I'm not selling them in the auction is because if you guys bought a whole set of that in the auction, it would cost me a hundred or more just to ship it if there's that much. So I'm going to sell it in pieces. And um, I, I try not to get in trouble with Poshmark, but I do a little bit. I push it. I push it. So let me measure this. And because, you know, I like to give my customers the best I can. It's 11 and a half inches from handle to handle. And it's two and three fourths inches up to here. 
I'm going to start this at 20. Do we have anyone interested in this casserole? And if you're interested in this design, I have lots of stuff that can go with it. Callie, uh, I have enough to do like two complete sets of this. And the only problem is I'm going to sell them like dinner plates. I'll do the sugar and creamer together. I... I can't sell the whole set in one box because it would cost me so much. It'd be too heavy and Poshmark would get mad at me and uh, it would cost me a fortune because I pay over what I have to pay over uh, what you got. You know, a lot, I pay shipping on a lot of the stuff you guys get plus the shipping you guys pay, but I, I end up paying I'm not complaining about it. I'm just saying China is so heavy and a complete set like this, send, sending it in one box, it just can't happen. <laughs> but anyway, uh, if anyone's interested in this, but we can do it in pieces. And I've got like four different sets of China right now that's really beautiful and antique. I mean, vintage and stuff. So we're going to pass on this. It's got the green leaves and the gold flowers. It is called um, Andrea, and it is from that place I don't pronounce. You guys know. All right. But you're, people get complete sets from me. They just get them, you know, <laughs> in different packages. All right. We're going to pass on this. Yes, Alexis, that's right. Uh, I would get in trouble. They can kick me off for that, you know. But I don't think they would. I'll, I can set this over here. Okay. This this goes in like the stuff that I sold. Yeah, but this didn't. Like... No, that's sold. I'm oh. just going to leave it. Uh, this this is sold. We can leave it right here. Oh, okay. just don't want him to get that. Yeah, I, I made that he's like a little trouble bird. I know. I made that mistake once. And caught him. He thinks he runs the show. <laughs> All right, guys. But yesterday, or not yesterday, seems like yesterday. I showed you the set, the blue flowery set. And this is the casserole that goes to the um, platters. And one of that, that rectangular one was a sandwich board or a sandwich platter. That's what it was called. And it's really rare, but it's on Poshmark now. But this is the casserole that matches those. And I have complete everything in this pattern. And see the cute handles on it? I just love it. This is the Indies. It's made in England by Johnson Brothers. It's a genuine hand engraving ironstone. And I have the full set of everything in this. Everything. I'm going to start this at $20 if anyone's interested. Okay. Yes, Callie. Oh, yeah, Callie, that would work. Oh, if that's what you're doing, I can do some heavy-duty packing so that you can have some very dramatic unveilings because <laughs> you know I love the tape. There you go. Is anyone interested in this? It is $20 or we can pass. I'm going to do an auction tomorrow morning from 10 to 12. Okay, we're going to pass on this one. That's okay. That's okay. Oh, dear. You know what? I think I am going to do something here and you're thinking about time right <laughs> what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna call it a day and i'm gonna spend the rest of the day organizing my lots because this is the first time i've ever done it randomly like that the dogs are protecting me from ricky yep <laughs> she's a they think she's uh harming gonna harm me uh if she was gonna do that it would have happened in high school 
All right. I think that's what we'll do. I'm going to use the rest of the afternoon, give some thought, and do like I normally do. I group things together. And so tomorrow at 10, we'll go crazy and get a bunch of stuff to get together for you. And I hope that works. And I do hope you're here tomorrow. We'll do it for two hours. And then after us at 12, I think one or two, Wade's going to do his whatnot auction too. So, and we did get a couple letters and I can't wait to read them, but we want more letters so we can get it going. And I'd appreciate anybody that sends one. Thank you so much. And I have to tell you, uh, I can't wait to find out what's in them. I love good stories and it can be anything, anything you want to talk about that you'd rather not talk about to your family. And believe me, I can think of dozens and dozens of items like that <laughs> my family you know anyway um thank you guys for coming thank you for being so sweet to ricky i appreciate that 10 o'clock tomorrow morning pacific time i will be organized and ready to go i will have crafter items i will have all kinds of items i will have clothes i will have metal i will have lots of stuff i will even have something no i don't want to tell you i have something i want to surprise you with so anyway thank you all so much i appreciate you so much for coming i really do i'm sorry if i'm cutting this a little short but i feel like i'll be here if i am awake you can even be here if you're sleeping ed we don't care if you're snoring or anything you can come <laughs> just, just turn it on and go back to sleep but we like having you here i have the greatest um, moderators deborah callie ed all of you are so fun and so great thank you guys and thank every one of you guys for showing up i will get organized and see you tomorrow at 10 a.m be here bye i do better organized